President Donald Trump is making it official, defying all the globalists and naysayers by pulling out of the disastrous Iran nuke deal. This was Barack Obama's deal, one he viewed as a huge shining accomplishment. Now, the former president and his minions are freaking out as Trump dropped another bombshell, revealing Obama's darkest secret that he thought no one would ever know. Former President Barack Obama told us he was saving us from all-out nuclear war. He said that if we didn't sign on to his brilliant foreign policy accomplishment called the Iran nuke deal, America would regret it as we watched Iran become a nuclear state who would immediately go to war. As a candidate, Donald Trump called out the Iran nuke deal as the worst deal ever. He promised Americans he would pull out of the deal. He kept that promise today, but it was not easy. President Trump had the entire European community, especially France and Germany, begging him to stay in the deal. In the end, Trump reinstated the toughest nuclear economic sanctions on Iran, making it clear there is a new sheriff in town, saying, I will sign a presidential memorandum reinstating the highest level of economic sanctions on the Iranian regime, and any nation caught helping Iran could also be strongly sanctioned. America will not be held hostage to nuclear blackmail. Obama's lackeys have been out in force, bad-mouthing Trump and saying that if he pulled out of the deal, it would be catastrophic. Obama's UN ambassador and pro-Palestinian flunky Samantha Powers tweeted, I will never forget the dark cloud that hung over the White House in the years Iran was advancing nuclear program and Obama was briefed on all the risks of using military force. She added, Trump has demolished America's credibility and paved the way for Iran to restart its nuclear program. Trump has done the unthinkable, isolated the US and rallied the world around Iran. The costs of using military force have only increased. Ms. Powers is a liar. Iran never stopped its nuclear program, and they have been laughing their butts off over in Tehran ever since Obama bowed down like a supplicant, asking for forgiveness and giving them billions, all the while knowing they were never going to stop producing nukes. Former President Obama and his tight circle of loyalists know this is the darkest secret, which they kept from the American people. Now, they are terrified as Trump tells the world Obama knew all along Iran, wasn't ever going to comply with the Iran nuke deal. Foreign policy expert Nate Jackson reported, Obama's nuclear deal was built on lies, just as we said from the beginning. The worst part is that Obama and his Secretary of State, John Kerry, weren't duped, they were part of the con, all in search of a legacy for Obama. And what a horrible legacy it was too. This is why Obama's former Secretary of State John Kerry went rogue, violating the Logan Act. As The Hill reported, former Secretary of State John Kerry had reportedly been meeting with Iranian interlocutors and strategizing with them in a way that one can only assume is meant to counter the Trump team's approach and limit its options. Kerry knew if Trump pulled out, he and Barack would be exposed. So, he ran around contacting Iranian officials when he has no authority. Only a desperate man horrified with the thought that Americans would find out the truth that he and his boss Obama were in on the con, would act in such an illegal and reckless manner. Bloomberg's Eli Lake reported, beyond the fate of the nuclear deal, the Israeli intelligence also presents a crisis for the 1970 Nuclear Non-Proliferation Treaty, to which Iran is a member. Now verified, it shows that Iran has systematically lied to weapons inspectors for nearly 20 years. If Iran doesn't pay a price for its deception, then what is to stop future rogues from following the Iran model? 
as Trump concluded his speech today, he pointed out that Secretary of State Mike Pompeo is on his way to North Korea. This was done today to also show Kim Jong-un that America isn't playing around. Trump's actions make it clear to North Korea that the only path they have is to denuclearize the Korean Peninsula. As Sean Davis tweeted, with the Paris climate deal dead, the Iran nuclear deal on life support and Obamacare eviscerated, Obama's only real legacy at this point is the presidency of Donald Trump. Barack Obama's darkest secret was his sick allegiance to Iran, as he screwed the American people into a nuke deal that was always a con which he was in on. Today, President Donald Trump has exposed the Obama administration's lies, shredding Barack's so-called accomplishments and making his real legacy the presidency of Donald Trump.